by the way, um, as another comment about the recent kerfuffle in exchange with the uh, disagreeable party, um, what I noticed is, because I, I keep my calm, right? I uh, generally don't become unkind and uh, defensive in my energy anymore, and that is because... I don't actually identify with my opinions. I am just a radio that broadcasts ideas, concepts, musings, consciousness. But I don't identify with any of them. So that's why you can believe whatever you want. You can hold whatever opinion you want, even... My uh, counterpart here that uh, we had to part ways because it wasn't about the opinions or beliefs that this person held. It's the energy. It's the contentious energy um, that is behind the words, behind the person um, that I cannot tolerate in my space. Again, I don't care what you believe, but if you bring friction energy, contentious energy into my field, I'm going to have to ask you to leave or I'm going to have to block you. Right? It's the energy that is um, not harmonizing. So believe what you want, but your energy is generated by your wounds, by your shadows. And because you have still so many shadows to clear, you cannot, um, you can't remain neutral when someone rejects you, right? Because you identify with your ideas. Yeah, believe me, I have learned this lesson of rejection. I have learned it with my twin flame. <laughs> and I threw a tantrum and I threw a fit and I was a real... Uh, my narcissism came out really, really strong. The abandonment and rejection wound, like I mentioned in a previous video, that felt like, how dare you reject me? How dare you try to control me? How dare you set a boundary? How dare you, you slam, a, slam the door shut in my face? <laughs> I learned my lesson and I got to know my shadows. And I healed my shadows. I transmuted my shadows. That's why I don't care now if somebody slams the door in my face or rejects me. I don't care. I felt that vibration to the nth degree. And I processed it through me until there was no longer a flare-up. Like a propane burst. You know, I, I let that flare up and flare up inside of me, not with other people or against other people, but within myself, I let that fire ignite and flare up and flare up and flare up until the last pain was devoured by the flame, by the twin flame. <laughs> and I'm cured. I am healed of the abandonment and rejection wounds. And, uh, that's why I don't care. You can believe whatever you want. Just don't bring your contentious, challenging, agitating energy into my field. I'm going to have to block you. Learn to play nice. All right? If you call that controlling you, well, sometimes a little child needs to have parental controls because it's too immature to know how to conduct itself in the company of adults, all right? So, just play nice, and there wouldn't be a problem. But I'm not blaming you because I know why you can't play nice. You need to do 
your shadow work. Please. And then you can come back and play with the rest of 